always ensure you have a camera mounted before turning on the gimbal, and that it's balanced. Long press the power button to turn on the gimbal. The gimbal boots up. Connect the camera to the gimbal over Wi-Fi or using the shutter cable provided. Press the record button. The camera will start recording video. Press the record button the second time to stop the recording. Press the capture button. The camera will take a photo. Double click the trigger button. The gimbal will reset to the original position. Move the camera in any direction using the built-in joystick. Press the wheel in once to change the function. The wheel can be used to control different functions of the gimbal. You can control the pan, tilt, or roll axis independently, directly from the wheel. This might be useful to level your horizon or make other position adjustments. The main use for the wheel, however, is to be used in conjunction with the follow focus attachment for your lens. This lets you control the focus on your lens directly from the handle itself. Lock mode. The camera stays in the same position no matter how you move the gimbal. It essentially locks the camera's rotational movement. Panning mode. It locks the tilt and roll axes, but the pan axis follows the gimbal movement. Pan tilt mode. Locks roll, but the pan and tilt follows the gimbal movement. Universal movement mode. Unlocks all movement axes. Manual locking mode. The pan and tilt axis can be manually positioned under the lock mode or the panning mode. Pull the camera to the desired angle and hold for a second to lock the position. Swipe your finger to the left across the screen to enter the advanced modes menu. Inception mode. Inception mode adds a creative visual effect, spinning the camera into a barrel roll. It can be used vertically or horizontally. Selfie mode. Selfie mode spins the camera so you can film yourself. It's ideal for vlogging. Portrait mode will be grayed out until you tip the gimbal to a horizontal position. Then it will become available in the advanced modes menu. Tap the mode. The camera will automatically orient itself to portrait mode, ideal for creating vertical content for Instagram or other platforms. Motion time-lapse mode. Connect your camera using the shutter cable. Enter the time settings. Adjusting the pan and tilt settings changes the total record time of your time-lapse for each axis. The values should be the same for simplicity purposes, but can differ based on how you want your time-lapse to look. Set your interval time, which is the wait time between each photo being taken. Dwell time. It lets you control how long the camera waits before firing the shutter. This is useful to let the gimbal take time to settle before firing the next shot. Enter route parameters. Here, you are setting the start and end points of your time lapse. This is done by manually positioning the camera angle. The time lapse will start automatically. Swipe your finger across the screen to enter the camera control menu. Depending on the compatibility, some other camera functions may also be controlled directly from the handle, such as ISO or exposure compensation. Long press the multifunction wheel to switch to camera control. Spin the wheel to digitally zoom. Camera control functions are only supported with certain cameras. The Manfrotto handle is the perfect accessory that allows you to go remote. A second operator can easily control the gimbal functionality 
while you focus on directing the shot and following the motion. Press and hold the on button to turn on the handle. To establish the connection on the handle itself, single press the settings button on the side. Move the joystick to the right to enter the set menu. Move the joystick to the right to select BLE scan. Select the gimbal to connect to from the list. You can use the handle to mimic your hand motion using the built-in gyro. This offers seamless control from up to 15 meters away. Engage the gyro functionality by pressing and holding the trigger on the handle and simply twisting it side to side for pan and tilting it back to front for tilt. The gimbal will automatically follow your hand movements. You can attach the handle to the gimbal with the provided accessories. The handle functionality is used when the gimbal is held in the underslung position. Check Manfrotto.com for compatibility.